And computer science in general is very important for students to learn and understand because we're in the midst of a new technological revolution uh, that should equal or surpass the industrial revolution. Uh, computing and, uh, and programming in general is used in every industry in America. Uh, there is literally not a single field that you do not need uh, uh, at least somebody who can understand how to program, how to write code, how to write websites. Uh, to fulfill that need, we offer um, many computer science courses, including AP Computer Science Principles. The focus of that is a, a broad uh, overview of all the topics in computer science. Um, there are seven big ideas that we cover, uh, and we do it in a collaborative and creative manner. But then our overarching project was to create a program that can read a double file and then find the mean, median, mode, and standard deviation. So I think the thing that's special about AP Computer Science Principles is um, that we learn more about the data itself and how to handle it and different ways to solve problems. I think it's a lot different than just learning how to code and learning each line and just the logic behind it. It's more than just logic, it's abstract, so there's um, a lot of unique things to it. Well, in the past, I didn't have a lot of experience with computer science and programming. I really did like the class. I thought it was beneficial and taught me a lot of skills. I feel really prepared going into AP. Um, I decided to take this class because my computer science teacher recommended it to me, but before the school year, I kind of had this frenzy thinking, I can't do this because it's an AP class. It's a college level course and I'm only a freshman and I just came from exploring computer science, but then the first couple of days, I really got into it and I think it was a better transition than I expected it to be. Hey, John, John Hansen had a good one. Will he graduate? Oh, oh, oh boy. <laughs> but uh, the reason I took this class is because I know that for my future career path, I'm going to need at least a basic understanding of computers and how to use them. I get to learn a lot of things I'm going to use in my future, no matter what profession that I go into, because I haven't really decided that yet. I know I'm going to use what I'm learning now. It will help to uh, deliver students the soft skills that industry are looking for, including creativity, collaboration, and problem solving, uh, so that they can adapt to the new workforce uh, needs of the 21st century.